Hey Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This is a love romantic relationship reading for you Aquarius. I hope you're well. The reading for today Aquarius is will they reach out tarot reading session for you. This is applicable for singles, couples in a relationship, dating or getting to know. And this is for my beautiful Aquarius friends out there. Okay. Please universal energy. What can I get for Aquarius? What is the message for Aquarius? Will they reach out tarot reading session for my Aquarius friends, okay. First card is the Page of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, the Ten of Swords, the Nine of Swords, the Six of Wands in reverse. What's the immediate future advice and outcome? Two of Wands, wow, okay. Let's clarify the past situation for you, Aquarius. The Hangman, hmm. The Ten of Swords, oh wow, Ace of Wands, okay okay all right okay let's start your reading Aquarius so in the past situation I feel like you know your person um, your your person they have some sort of affection you have a soft soft spot with your person you're important with your person okay um, there's some sort of hesitation in the past okay I feel like the past situation they hesitate apologizing calling you texting you or showing the real feelings they're kind of scared they they're waiting for some stuff to happen be, before they could express or commit because queen of pentacles you mean so much to me i care about you you have a soft spot but um i need to release detach you because i need to figure out something because the hangman is that they need to release detach or slow progress they're looking out for something. I'm not sure whether it's a responsibility with finance, career, or ex-husband or ex-wife, or a, something to do with external of your love connection or reconnection. For some of you, it could be it's quite overwhelming that they couldn't find the right path to the right direction to make it grow. Because this Queen of Pentacles, you know, there's plants growing in here. And inside the Queen of Pentacles is the Pentacles, which is you. They like you. They miss you. You're important to them, but they hesitated for something. Something fishy. Like they... This is like second guest or chicken out or fear or ego. They're scared to open up their feelings towards you. Something that they need to go through. Okay? Um... Yeah, I feel like for some of you, they were apologizing, but they hesitate to say that apology. They want to do something, share something to you, but they hesitated. Instead of apologizing, texting, calling you, or opening up their feelings, they second, they had a second thought. Because I feel like this hangman in reverse, they release something, but it's not what, it's not what they, it's not what, it's not what really it is, you know. They, they've given you... Could be you fight, you know, you had a fight, um, ego, miscommunication, misunderstanding. So instead of saying something good, they said something bad impulsively because you are fighting. Could be that. So the current energy is Ten of Swords. Yeah, the card, healing. They're waiting for the bad cycle, the bad vibe to end. Because Ten of Swords, this is an end of a bad cycle. This is an end of problem. So they wait, they're waiting for you and them to kind of move on with things you said or they said or they do or you did that has disappointed both parties because you've got here the ace of wands they're what they have for you something big what they have for you something because i feel like this page of cups in it this is petty you know this is among past to present this is the one that's really bothering me it's only a page but it's so petty it could be I don't know, simple things that blown out of proportion because someone was needy, insecure, or jealous. But it was petty. So there's a need for you guys to mature emotionally and intellectually the way you decide. In terms of love, romantic, and, you know, in, in terms of some, because sometimes we act childish when we are in a romantic or getting to know. No matter how mature you are, sometimes you act immaturely because of love it does so i feel like 
something petty was blown out of proportion jealousy possessiveness insecurity you know picking a fight without any reason because he wanted to feel secure so there's bigger plan all right ace of wands this person they have they care for you and they have big plans for you if they're not reaching out it's because they're waiting for things to slow like you come out from bad cycle nine of swords they think and think and think of you on how to to reach out this is the current energy okay okay you know your person okay there's a card that drop off you know your person they try to move on they try to move on they try to forget you okay this is current energy current they try to move on they try to forget you but in 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 the process of moving on forgetting you ignoring you you know nine of swords overthinking cannot sleep at night you aquarius makes difficult thing for me <laughs> ten and nine and ten. Oh, aquarius you're making the thinking of you is so difficult it's so hard it's difficult something like that because what they have you know when you have big bigger plans with a person great plans great take you know they have bigger plans for you that's what i'm really getting in here so when you have good big plan for someone it takes a lot of effort and thinking so they try to move on but they couldn't and at the end i feel like king of wands instead of moving on they will face you and see how they could bring this over in more of longevity because king of wands is about long term okay because this 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 energy in here they try to fight off and resist like nah and then eventually they surrender to themselves and say i cannot ignore aquarius you know this ace of wands this is intimidating their feelings and passion towards you won that instead of resisting i'm just gonna face it off king of wands so they'll definitely reach out discreetly it could be a simple thumbs up in social media very discreet um also i'm getting like it's not very obvious um it could be a pretending message oh they wrong send or they miss call oh sorry i i don't meant to call you but actually they're just making excuses so it's it's a very discreet way of reaching out see if you look at the the star card it's a very discreet a discreet way of reaching out they don't want to be obvious okay so for example they would text you and say oh um how's the dog how's the kids and then they will change the topic to oh it's been a while do you want to catch up so it's a very discreet um <laughs> it's a very discreet message and a discreet way of reaching out and eventually trying to connect rekindle with you this is what they wish for they wish for you to accept this discreet connection it's a, like a pretending person that they don't like you but they do so they would send you some silly message or um miss call pretend to miss call but actually they do was intending to send you that or call you because the star card isn't here they're in the hope that you will pay attention or they'll sprinkle attention to them Two of Wands, they will be very happy if you accept the connection, if you start calling, texting again. Now they can proceed with their plan, future plan. At some point, this person uh, would hold back, would have to reshuffle things. Four of Pentacles, this is holding back. Once your person feels comfortable, if, if you allow this person to come through, to let them in, um, they would they would slow down because they need to reshuffle, reschedule in order to give way of you joining their life okay like they need to clear clear they need to clear their space their mind their mind you know their mind and heart because what they have is passion you know wants 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 passion driven by passion and feelings and then when it stabilizes, because this is an earth sign capricorn taurus or virgo energy once the passion and once the reconnection is stable how to ground it is to hold back a little bit to slow progress to clean to clear up and make sure that it's something longevity okay so enjoy this ride okay enjoy this moment with this person they've got plan they will look after you at some point in the immediate future there would be a slowdown don't be upset don't be angry it's a curve ball you know it's it's like a 
turbulent time. The way you start off with this person is shaky, turbulent. And then there would come a point that it's gonna be slow, smooth. And this is Four of Pentacles. I don't think this is bad because if you look at the Four of Pentacles, the fruits around them, it's ready to drop. So just they just need to hold back a little bit, think, think one day or two days and they will ready to drop everything for you. It's like getting married. When you get married, you have jitters. They're kind of, they're excited. Yeah, so they hold back and excited and then eventually they let it go and the fruits would just drop down. The fruit of the labor. Okay, so this is good. All right. So keep an eye on this person because I feel like for some of you it's an email, it's a WhatsApp or a Viber. If you have unblock, if you have blocked this person, unblock them now, and um, so that their message could come through, could come through, through and through, through and through. Okay. So thank you guys. It's a pleasure doing this reading for you guys. I hope you like it. I hope I get the thumbs up. If you're guest viewers, I appreciate guys. If you click subscribe, join my team. And don't forget to click the bell because the notification bell will um, update you whenever I have uploaded a new video. You have a great weekend, guys. I'll see you soon again. Take care and bye-bye.